this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to create a Christmas tree in Blender 2.93. Firstly, we need to add the tree gem add-on. Go to Edit, Preferences, and search for the tree gem. Delete the cube, shift A, curve, and sapling tree gen. Go down here and then scroll down to roll preset and click on small pine. Go to geometry and set it onto band spirit. Set the levels to 3. Now, go to leaves and click on show leaves. Now, let's set up the light. We are going to create the lights for the tree. For that, we need a new collection. Right click scene collection and then click on new collection. Now let's rename the collection. Double click the collection and name it lights. Now click on lights, shift A, mesh, and icosphere. Get all this icosphere down and move it somewhere else. Let's make three of these icospheres. These are gonna be the lights for our tree, and we're gonna have three colors. Light. Now, let's create the particle system for the tree. Click on the leaves, go to the particle properties, and then click on the plus sign. This will add a new particle property to the leaves. Go to here, and then go down to render. Go to the vendor as drop down menu and click on collection. Now go down to collection and the instance should be lights. Now, now we can scale it down. Go to scale and put it to 0 0.04. Also increase the random scale. Now scroll up and set the number to 100. These are the lights for our tree. Now let's uh, set up the color. Go to report shading. This icosphere. Go to material properties and then click new. Go to the surface and put it as emission. Let's put the color of this as red. Also, remember to put the strength to 5.
the render properties and then click on ambient occlusion and blue. Now, let's click on light and untick it. Now let's make the landscape, so shift A, mesh and plane. Go to edge select. Select this edge and extrude it in the z-axis. Go to the modifiers tab, add modifier and add the bubble modifier. Increase the amount and set the segments to 12. Thank you for watching the video. See you next time.